This is what happens when you look up at night and there are no clouds in the sky. It's not overcast at all. But somehow, for nights in a row, weeks in a row, months, there's somehow no moon and there's never any stars. I don't know if I'm the only one who notices this. Like, Jared, look everywhere. Yeah, no. And isn't this like nights that there hasn't been a moon? Yeah. For forever. Like, because somebody might say, no yeah, and there's no clouds, right? Yeah, go in the middle. yeah, exactly. I don't know if you can hear him, but he's agreeing with me. Because somebody might say, oh, it's, it's the tilt of the earth. It's sometimes there's not a moon. For weeks? For weeks. And there's no clouds. Like, it's been a clear night. Like like almost every night. And then there's like five pretend stars that look like satellites. And some people try to say that this is due to light pollution, but um, it's not like I grew up in the country or anything. I, I grew up like near Dayton, Ohio. I mean, I, I did grow up in the Burbs in Centerville, Ohio, but it was right near Dayton, Ohio. You know, our, our huge downtown. You know, it's not, I wasn't like in a country area. And when I would look up at night, even with the light pollution in Ohio, I would see billions, trillions of stars. And the moon, it, would, it was like impossible to count the amount of stars that there were. It was just impossible. Like it was so magnificent that I literally... I wanted to be an astronaut. It was so amazing. And, um, yeah. I, I just I wanted to go up there because I would look up every single night and it looked like that. I first started noticing that there was literally something wrong with the sky when I moved to Texas. And, um, everybody's, I don't know, maybe everyone's trying to say, oh, you're blaming everything on Texas. It's just not my fault that a whole bunch of bad things I always notice about Texas. So I first started noticing that there weren't any stars at all and that occasionally there would be no moon for for like weeks or months when I moved to Texas. And um, it just doesn't make any sense because it won't be cloudy and there will be like 10 stars. And um, it's not light pollution, like I said, or anything like that. Cause I would see, when I would see the magnificent view of the sky that I would see in Ohio, like I said, it's not like I grew up in, in the middle of the country, like in the countryside or anything like that. And so I, I don't know how people are blaming light pollution for their, there being no stars. Like if I got a telescope right now, when I was younger, I, w I would always look at this um, telescope by this company called Mead. I don't know if there still exists, but there was this telescope, it was like $400. And, um, you know, since I was young, I always thought to myself, well, I'm, I don't have enough money right now because I'm only like 13, but one day I'm going to save up, you know, money. I'm going to buy that telescope that's super expensive and I'm going to sit it down and look at all the bajillions of stars that I see every night. And I'm going to look at the planets and, you know, I always just thought, oh, I'll get to it. I've got time. It's not like the stars are going to disappear, but... I guess I was wrong because I don't know, I don't know what it is that's, that's going on. I don't know if it's just my life, you know, like if it's, it's some sort of dome or I'm, I'm in sort of B budget illusion or I don't know what's going on. I just know that the sky does not look right and I seem to be the only one who notices. Like I don't know how nobody else can notice. I'm not even that old. Do, they, do old people notice this? Like, how can I remember this? Are there any old people out there who are, like, looking up, like, like, what, what happened? Because this is not light pollution. Like I said, I was around the same amount of lights when I used to see billions, the uncountable amount of stars and amazing-looking moon every single night. Like, what the heck happened?
Like, it, it, what is it, like you moved to Texas and then like even, even the stars disappear in your life? Like, well, what is this?